Hi, I'm the Nature Kid, and in this video, I'm going to tell you how and why you should keep chickens as pets. First, I'm going to tell you why you should keep chickens as pets. The first reason is kind of obvious. They lay eggs that you can eat. On average, a chicken will lay about one egg each day. Although chickens do stop laying eggs when they get old. And it's also a way to know where your food comes from. On average, food travels about 1,500 miles before reaching the breakfast plate. But if you have chickens, the eggs you eat it can be e coming right from your own backyard. Also, with chickens, you can recognize the eggs that they lay because different chickens lay different looking eggs. Another reason why you should keep chickens is because they make really good pets. Like this chicken right here, her name is Dolly. Dolly is very cuddly. Dolly likes to come up to me and put her head over my shoulder and she likes to get hugs. And also chickens really, really like chin rubs. So cuddly. Yeah. Chickens, especially Dolly, are so cuddly. Dolly is so cuddly. Not only do chickens lay eggs and are very cuddly, chickens also eat the pests and weeds in your garden. Also, chicken manure is really good for plants. It's good fertilizer. So, do you want a pet who makes food for you every day? and eats the pests in your garden and makes fertilizer then you might want a chicken did you know that chickens are trainable but now i'm going to tell you about how to take care of pet chickens. First, you need a chicken yard. You just need a fence surrounding an area that is where you have your chicken coop. Put straw on the ground in your chicken yard so oh, that it doesn't look as messy and so that they have something to scratch around in. The chicken coop is where the chickens sleep at night and so what they do is they climb up these stairs and then go into the chicken coop. If the chickens need to lay eggs, they go in here. And
and at night they sleep in here. Put chicken bedding at the bottom of the coop. Sometimes the chickens will wake up in the middle of the night and go poop. So you sometimes need to change the bedding out. The feeder is under the chicken coop. It is where the chickens eat their food. The chickens step on this part to open the feeder using a spring. Close the feeder at night to keep pests out. And then in the morning, the chickens can go down the stairs that are in here and then come out. At night, we have to close the coop here. We do the, we pick up this wire and put it down so that this closes and then lock it up to keep predators out. And we also close this door. And this is for their water. And they drink from here because the water in this container goes into these little cups. Depending on the number of chickens you have, you should have different sized coop or chicken yard. For a large flock of chickens, you should have a lot of space, and for just a few chickens, you should have a smaller coop and yard. During summer, winter, and fall, you can let your chickens out of their yard. Just be careful during spring because they sometimes eat seedlings. Sometimes chickens will dirt bathe in, in your garden and this can damage plants. Learn more about dirt bathing by watching my video, a short documentary about chickens. But basically dirt bathing is when chickens roll around in dirt and dig around in it and it's actually very important for them because it is good for their feathers and dislodges bacteria and parasites. So if you want long-lived healthy chickens you should allow them to dirt bathe. But how do you prevent them from dirt bathing in your garden but still let them dirt bathe. You can fill a pot up with the soil or a tray up with soil and put it in your chicken yard. They can dirt bathe in there. But we don't have the problem of chickens dirt bathing in the garden very much. So we don't really have to do that. And if you're wondering what are the chickens' names, these are what their names are. This is Cookie Pot. This is Dolly. This is Buffy. This is Maple. And this is Honey. And I'm sorry about the bad resolution because it is very dark in the coop, but this is Venus. I hope you liked the video. Like and subscribe for more Nature Kid videos. Bye!